Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> it is E3 season. Slide over here and make sure my camera's fixated the correct way. There we are. It's hot. So, uh, anyway, E3 season. Uh, and we're starting it off with this Pokemon Direct. Uh, who knows what this will be? Uh, a lot of people are speculating it's going to be Pokemon for the Switch, um, which is exciting. Uh, some people have speculated MMO. Um, I don't know how I feel about that, um, but we will see. Um, I'm excited um, and ready for this to kick off E3. I'm hoping this is a pretty hype drop here. If not, well, whatever. Um, We'll deal with it, but uh, at this point, it's supposed to start in another minute here, too. We're up bright and early. We have coffee. Let's go. Let's see this real quick. Here we go. Here we go. Hello everyone. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. Today, I'll be delivering the latest news about Pokemon from our offices. As many of you know, Nintendo launched its new system, Nintendo Switch, wow. on March 3rd. Yep, we know. You may even be playing some games on your own Nintendo Switch already. And now, finally, we are excited to announce a Pokemon game for the system. Our first what title kind of Pokemon Switch game will be the Pokemon fighting game, Pokemon Tournament Deluxe. Mm. Okay. We've prepared a special trailer uh, to showcase the game. If that's it. Let's take a look. Mm. Wow. Okay, that's live footage. <laughs> it's like, wow! <laughs> I did not know the Switch was capable of that. This trailer is all people Did the original Pokémon tournament do that well? Like They've showed literally five seconds of gameplay in this guy. I like the exclamation point. That's at least a throwback to, uh, you know, trainer battle, right? I wonder if they'll incorporate that into the game somehow. Like, play a random person in public and get this achievement or something. That'd be kind of cool, I think. This is such a weird trailer. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> There's a lot of negative reaction going on right now. Oh, what's... Whoa, 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 why did we freeze? That's better. That was weird. Okay, now they're showing 3DS Pokemon. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, okay. So. I hope you enjoyed that. Pokemon Tournament Deluxe takes full advantage of the variety of gameplay modes made possible by Nintendo Switch. You can, of course, connect your console to a TV to enjoy dynamic Pokemon battles on a larger screen, or if you want, you can play in tabletop mode, share one of your Joy-Con with another player, and dive into a match anytime, anywhere. In the Wii U version of Pokemon Tournament, players could choose from 16 playable Pokemon. In addition to those, the Nintendo Switch version will include Darkrai, Scizor, Empoleon, and Krogunk, as well as Decidueye from Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon for a total of five new playable Pokemon. On top of that, you can enjoy three versus three team battles, as well as online ranked matches and friend-only group matches. We're really giving it the deluxe treatment. DX, that's what Token that stands Tournament for. Deluxe will launch on September 22nd. Starting on June 13th in LA at this year's E3, one of the world's largest gaming conventions, we will have a playable demo for you to enjoy at the show. We're also planning on including this title on Nintendo Treehouse Live. In addition, the game will be featured in its own full-on invitational tournament at E3 as an on-stage event, which we're live streaming right from the show floor. So please look forward to it. As for Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon, which we announced in that new trailer just a few moments ago, I would like to pass it on to someone who can tell you more about it. Okay. The 3DS yeah. lives. Hello everyone, I'm Masuda from Game Freak. I'd like to introduce you to the latest installments of the Pokemon series for the Nintendo 3DS family of systems, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon. These games offer an alternate story taking place in the world of Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon, featuring Pokemon that didn't appear in the original versions. New features will allow you to enjoy your adventure even more, making this truly an ultra title. Pokemon Ultra. Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon will see a simultaneous global release on the Nintendo 3DS family of systems November 17th. Please stay tuned for more information. What is this? I have one more announcement for you. All right. This fall, we'll release Pokemon Gold version and Pokemon Silver version for the Virtual Console service on Nintendo 3DS. That's exciting. Pokemon Gold version and Pokemon Silver version were originally released in 1999 as the second installment in the Pokemon series. Also kind of weird because you already remade releases, Gold and Silver though. We've recaptured all the fun of those original Game Boy Color games, and both will become compatible with the Pokemon Bank application. We hope you look forward to reliving the excitement all over again. The games will launch on the same day as Pokemon Tournament Deluxe, September 22nd. I loved those games. Those two were Thank great. You, Mr. Masuda. We'll be hard at work on Pokemon Tournament Deluxe for Nintendo Switch. Pokemon but you, Ultra Sun you already made Pokemon Soul Ultra Silver and what was it? Uh, Heart and Gold? Gold version, like, and Pokemon Silver version for the Nintendo 3DS Virtual Console service for all of you Pokemon fans. That's it for today. Wow. Uh, I'm kind of speechless at that Nintendo um, there's some stuff to dissect there um, it's kind of uh, man it's not exactly what I was hoping for this morning you know you 
I don't know. You 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 make this announcement days before E3, right? Days before E3. It's like you're jumping ahead of all everybody at E3 to drop this announcement. Um, and then it's Pockin' Tournament DX. Um, to me, that feels like anti-hype. Um, I'm not going to say it's as bad as like when uh, Sony at PSX said, Hey, Final Fantasy VII port coming. Um, <laughs> um, but it kind of feels like that. It's like the same, same deal. So maybe they are uh, setting us up for what's going to happen at E3. Uh, hey, you know, getting us all anti-hyped a little bit. Um, I mean, you can hope that, but this this felt very like, oh, hey, they're doing something with Pokemon on Switch, and then it's just Pokemon Tournament. Uh, I, for me, maybe there's a group of people out there that love Pokemon Tournament, but for me, that's, that's not exciting. Um, maybe people in the fighting game community really love that. Um... But, I mean, there are so many good fighting games that just came out. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe there's some hype going on. But to me, that feels very anticlimactic and uh, not exactly what I was hoping for um, for the first Pokemon game on the Nintendo Switch. So, we'll see. Uh, who knows what's going to happen. Uh all right, thanks for watching me, uh, watching this with me, guys. Uh, as always, I'll be back here for the rest of E3. Uh, Buckeye734, you can find me on Twitch and YouTube. Hope you guys have an awesome day.